say, I'm going to be suggesting a few videos with the kid call. Well, I know for sure that I think Reagan suggested about this, maybe doing like kid call videos just to like, you know, that if you suggest a kid call, I wonder if she's going to do that for her next time. But I'm sort of thinking if I could like, you know, suggest a few like, you know, kid call videos that might be like, you know, suitable for your kid call theme, then I might as well recommend them because I know there's a few like, you know, kid call videos that you can select from. I think there's probably like, you know, a few that you could go with, but. I'm only going to stick around eight suggestions for today anyway, so let's get into it, shall we? So for our first video, we have Stitches. Well, I know it's like, you know, the most popular video there is. And I know that like, he's been in tier one for a while, even though he's not like, you know, like, you know, number one in tier one. But there are a lot, lot of like, you know, people who keep having Stitches on their arms these days. So I'm thinking to myself, he's definitely a good, like, you know, kid core related Beard's suggestion because he's kind of got that sort of kid call vibe that everyone's kind of looking for in a way so he's definitely like you know more of a suggested beard that I'll probably recommend like you know really and plus the only two reasons why I'll go for stitches if he wants to do kid call rhymes is that he's exotery he's kind of using like kind of like you know primary colors even though his door frame looks very like you know secondary color colors but inside there's a lot of kid, kid core related items and plus he's got like his little picnic area where all his like his sort of toys and that stuff are like laying on there and I quite like that. I quite like his um, house interior but you could always like you know remodel it to make it more kid core related if you want if you have the Happy Home Paradise DLC etc but I do have him on my other eye as well so I have like you know remodeled his house just to make it look more kid core related but there are a few other videos that you could probably like you know suggest for kid core as well but let's get to the next video just shall we for my next video suggestion we have Pudge well I'm kind of thinking to myself is that you might have to remodel his exterior because it's it's basically like more secondary colors not primary colors it might be looking for for kid cause so I'm kind of recommending is that if you have to have your own paradise DLC it might be easier if you could like you know remodel it after you like complete a few vacation homes so i'm kind of thinking to myself is that if you do have to like you know remodel his exterior only then feel free to so i feel like that's a bit of a, bit of a letdown that his exterior doesn't fit the kid core aesthetic even though in his interior it's more kid core related because i quite like his interior there's a lot of like kid core arms thrown around the place and like the the actual wallpaper and floor and it kind of fits like the kid core vibe you know there's a few other kid core videos that i could also suggest but probably be in now one now I suggest let's get to the next one shall we so for my third video suggestion i'm gonna recommend cody because he kind of looks like a cowboy doesn't he and i'm thinking he gives me those kid core vibes straight away even though i've had him as a starter on sunflower before and he was definitely when i was thinking yeah he might not fit my vibe because I was looking for like a farm core vibe, not a kid core like kind of vibe in a way. So he didn't stay on there on my arm for that long either. But I was thinking he's definitely a good video suggestion that I could probably throw out there for you guys if you guys are looking for another kid core video, etc. I was thinking I quite like his exterior. He's using like, you know, kind of like the pastel colours, but again, I could always say primary colours because if you do more primary colours when it comes to kid core, then yes he will fit and also his interior has got a lot of like you know kid core items in here as well that's why i'm thinking he's a definitely good video suggestion if you guys want to do kid core because kid core is more challenging but you can use your imagination with it which is what i quite like even though i've not done it before i think i might you know do it as a challenge on my channel at some point if i want to do another round or like i want to say it or just you know make a new one or something like that i would like to do that soon but let's get to the next one shall we so for my full video suggestion i'm going to recommend jeremiah well i have seen him on leapfrog when i was doing my iron tour probably like you know a month ago because it's been so long since i've done an iron tour video etc but i was thinking because he kind of fits you know leapfrog very well and plus he's definitely one of um froggy crossing's favorite like you know frogs there are but she definitely likes the frog features to be honest and i was thinking if if, if i could have like you know jeremiah on kick or on my kick on if i wanted to do one then i would actually go for him because he's quite you know he's kind of cool he fits the kick or aesthetic you could always like you know like you know take him if you want it if you want to put him on your theater hunting list etc but 
the thing is i like his interior more than his exterior because his exterior is like you know a bit a bit too blue it's a bit out of the it's a little bit off i feel like if it, if you could like you know really like you know remodel his exterior if you have you know the happy happy home paradise dlc then yeah i recommend doing that before you know getting jeremiah etc so I'm thinking if you could try and do that, then the exterior would actually match the kick core aesthetic. It's only just the insides, like, you know, just a win-win. It's just the exterior just needs to be, like, you know, a bit more... Make sure it kind of stands out a little bit. You know what I mean? Let's get to our next suggestion, shall we? So for our fifth video suggestion, I'm going to go with um, Hugh. Well, the thing is, I was not really sure about what to sort of go for Hugh but I was thinking he would be definitely a good um kid core suggestion because he looks like you know he's got a little mixture of blues and plus he could fit your kid core on if you wanted him etc but I haven't seen much of him on kid core Ryan so I'm not sure if it's because he's kind of like you know underrated or something like that I'm not really sure but I feel like um he could probably fit kid core a little bit better because he looks um he kind of looks very blue, but he kind of looks kind of unique at the same time. But if you're looking at his, like, you know, house exterior and interior, they kind of suggest, you know, kid core straight away. So I kind of think he can also fit kid core as well. So if you guys think it to yourselves, if you want to do like a beard or hunt for Hugh, then just go for him. So I feel like he fits the vibe a little bit better. And I feel like he's definitely a good beard suggestion as well. So let's get to our next beard suggestion, shall we? For my sixth video suggestion, I recommend Bob because I know he's very, like, you know, very popular because he's, like, you know, born on the January the 1st. So I think he's kind of popular in a way because sometimes when I'm watching Crossing Channel's, like, you know, videos, sometimes I, I tend to see Bob around half the time. Plus, he's one of his favourite, like, you know, cat videos in the game. And plus, he's got, like, a, he's got, like, a members thing when it comes to, like, Bob's gang and that stuff. So I'm thinking Bob will be a very good video suggestion for Kid Core because... I know that Foggy Crossing also had Bob on Leapfrog as well, so it kind of makes sense that he will also fit Kid Core as well. And plus, I really like his exterior because it's more like he's like like he's using the primary colours on his exterior and interior. It's got all the like you know the wooden box kind of like you know furniture around it, so I quite like it. I really like how um his house exterior and interior like you know match his kind of like you know kick or personality as well. So I'm thinking yeah, I think Bob will also fit kick or very nicely as well. So I think he'll be like the best video suggestion I could probably give you. So I know that everyone's gonna go for Bob because he's so popular these days. So yeah, so he'll be one that everyone probably go with for kick or anyway. I'll say. So let's get to our next video suggestion, shall we? So for my seventh fear suggestion i recommend sydney well the thing is i quite like um sydney's kind of design in a way i feel like her um outfit kind of gives me kid core vibes so i'm thinking you could always go for sydney for kid core as well so it doesn't matter if it comes down to her kind of aesthetic in a way she could also be kid core and also fairy core i didn't know if she could probably fit into both cores but i think she could be good example for both of them to be honest well, I do like her her exterior though. It looks kind of like, you know, it looks like a log cabin sort of thing, but you could always change that if you wanted to like, you know, remodel it if you've like, you know, done Happy on Paradise and that stuff. Because you could always like, you know, remodel the interior of it or probably the exterior of it. But I do like her um, house interior though. She's got a lot of like kid core elements in there. And some of them look very pastel, so pastel kind of gives me the vibe that she could probably be suitable for very core as well. So really, I feel like she could sit, she could probably just fit both cores, like, you know, kid core and fairy core very well. So that's what I'll probably say on her sort of front really. Let's get to our last video suggestion, shall we? For my last video suggestion, we have Frobert, but I know you guys are thinking, why have I gone for Frobert in particular for, for Kid Core? Well, the only reason why I've kind of gone for him is that he kind of gives me that Kid Core vibe when you're kind of thinking about it. But the only reason why I think he's giving me the Kid Core vibe is because his interior gives me that vibe. But unfortunately, because I'm looking at his exterior, it looks a bit, you know, quite dark and gloomy and it doesn't fit Kid Core that well. What well, I could probably suggest for you is changing it up by using the 
Papio in Paradise DLC to remodel his exeter to make it look more Kiko like, you know what I mean? But you could always change his outfit to a Kiko bit as well because it might not fit the aesthetic very well. But he could also be um, a golf core figure as well, which I could probably like, you know, recommend. But you know what I mean? I, it was like a last minute thing really when I was thinking about should Throwbot be a good video suggestion? Well, I had to go with him in the end so I couldn't really think of any other videos to go for my eighth suggestion to be honest. So let's get to the last bit, shall we? if you want to do kick or in the future etc but it is definitely the most challenging quarter i would say because it took Roy crossing like probably a few months until finishing leapfrog so it took her a while so that's what i'm thinking it's the most challenging call you could always do but i think farm call won't take you that long i think it might like take you maybe like you know maybe like two to three months to do make sure you like on this video and if you're new to my channel and see more of my content please subscribe to the variety of content you might enjoy my vlog and my crossing content me too if you come to well probably like you know from tomorrow when it comes to one year kind of like you know special videos i'll probably go start ranking you know san video videos be good but i might not do it as a premiere i might just post this straight away in the morning or something like that so you guys can like you know see it first thing and that stuff or i'll probably do it in the afternoon it kind of depends really but it depends on my kind of like you know time and schedule etc but i'm also saying it probably like you know start tomorrow around 20 from the 28th from july to tuesday the 2nd of you know august so i was thinking it might be like a short period of time but at least you can start doing it early because i might have to like you know pre-record you know, I mean, I'm unboxing for you know Saturday, so you guys can like you know see it at 7 p.m. It depends what time zone you guys in as well. So I'll probably like you know if you guys can't make it, if you guys like you know can make it, if you guys are, like if your time zone is okay with it, then yeah, you guys can make it in that stuff. And also turn notifications over Animal Crossing and Newtopia content for this Friday and Friday crossing. I'll see you next one. So bye.